First responders in Ohio say seconds count when it comes to an emergency. They're hoping a new training facility in Paulding will prepare them for anything thrown their way. These Fox firefighters, Abby Jackson, has more. These firefighters aren't responding to a real emergency, but they know they'll be ready when they get called after training at the new facility in Paulding County. Many times we send individuals off to training, but it's difficult for us to train together as a department. For Edward Bone with Paulding County Emergency Management, a facility like this has been a dream for several years. That's when Bone approached commissioners about the need for additional training. But the project didn't get off the ground until last year. It was our legislators that stepped up and funded the project under the local government safety capital grant. And as I said, we were very fortunate to be one of 92 over, out of over 4,000 that submitted applications to make this happen. Our office is dedicated to uh, the safety of our first responders because most of them are volunteers. The facility uses donated wrecked vehicles in a building made completely of shipping containers to simulate emergency situations. The shipping containers, they're relatively cheap, easy to find, and quick to erect, and they withstand the heat. The facility also allows firefighters to see people and objects through a smoking building using thermal energy. The man behind the mechanics of the facility is Jared Page. I know the commissioners, and they kind of roped me into doing uh, metal work on it, so I did all the fabrication. But Bone says the training offered so far is only the first phase. Phase two is going to be larger scale props. We're going to have a roof, roof truss uh, simulator so firefighters can understand the dangers of the construction of roofs as well as having to perform ventilation cuts in them. In Paulding, Abby Jackson, Fox 55 News.